everybody. Welcome back to Florida Studio Theater here in Sarasota, Florida. My name is Caroline and I'm gonna help you with the fourth ingredient in your play, dialogue. Now dialogue is the words that the characters say. Let's start off working together to write some dialogue for my play, then you can start writing some for your own. Now to think of dialogue, it helps me to remember all of the ingredients that I already have. So imagine with me, my characters, Charlie the cheetah and Willow, the wise old tree, my setting, the jungle early in the morning, and the conflict. Charlie the cheetah wants to run really, really fast, but he can't because of his limp. Now let's imagine all of that together. Now, while we are imagining it, let's think. Who speaks first and what do they say? I think Charlie speaks first and he says, I wish I could run like all the other cheetahs. Now that we know who speaks first and what they say, we just have to write it down. Now, when we write dialogue for a play, we write it like this. We write the character's name, then we write a colon, which is two dots, one right on top of the other, like this. Then we write the line of dialogue, the words that the characters say, like this. With dialogue, I can also include how the character is feeling or what the character is doing by putting it in parentheses, like this. Let's say that I wanted Charlie to say those lines feeling sad. I would write sad in parentheses like this. Or if I wanted him to be doing something, I could include that in parentheses as well. Let's say I want him to be trying to run. I would include that in parentheses like this. Those parentheses let the actors know that you want them to do or feel something and not say those words. Here's my friend Kyle. He can show us. He's gonna play Charlie the Cheetah. Let's have him say the line of dialogue just as we wrote it. I wish I could run like all the other cheetahs. Now let's change those words in parentheses. Let's change sad to angry. <sighs> I wish I could run like all the other cheetahs. Next, we can change what he's doing. Let's change trying to run to stomping his feet. I wish I could run like all the other cheetahs. See, those words in parentheses make a big difference in how your play will be performed. You don't have to use them all the time, but if you want to include how a character is feeling or what they're doing, this is how you do it. Now let's go back to writing some more dialogue. Let's say Charlie the Cheetah just said, I wish I could run like all the other cheetahs. Who speaks next? I think it's probably Willow, the old tree. And I think she says, why would you wish that little cheetah? Look at that, we already have the first two lines of dialogue for my play. Now that you've helped me write the dialogue for mine, you're ready to get started with your own play. Go ahead and think up who are the characters in your play, in your setting, with the conflict that you've already created. And ask yourself, who speaks first and what do they say? Got an idea? Write it down just like we practiced and keep writing you have such amazing ideas. I can't wait to see what you write in your play.